The Democratic National Convention has officially started here in Milwaukee. Well, sort of. Since it's mostly virtual and not actually at the Wisconsin Center, it really sounds and looks like a whole lot of nothing. What's most disappointing is the city made a, a big facelift and nobody can see it. Mm -hmm. That's so ew, shameful. There wasn't much for Bill Spielberg from Milwaukee to take photos of outside the Wisconsin Center. He came to document the historic occasion, but instead got this. Really, the only people inside the Wisconsin Center were production crews making sure live streams of caucus panels and the primetime speeches went uninterrupted. Outside was just police officers, a few people taking photos, and a very small group of protesters. Although there was a Bulgarian and German news outlet there. Support several causes, not the least of which is the legalization of cannabis in Wisconsin. Oh, on the behalf of Bernie Sanders, someone had to be out here for him. Protesters for various causes showed up hoping to link up with a larger demonstration, but as of the early evening, there were no marches or rallies. But a low turnout isn't stopping these protesters, some who came from Maryland and Ohio, from spreading their message. Both of these groups said they plan to be here the entire convention. A one person protest is just as good as a million man protest. Outside the Wisconsin Center, it looked a bit like a ghost town, and it's possible that's what it'll look like for the rest of the convention. In Milwaukee, James Groh, TMJ4 News.